Hi, this is Richard Byrne. In this video, we're going to take a look at Google Spaces, which is something that Google just released yesterday. It's kind of an alternative to Google Plus Communities. It's a bit more streamlined than Google Plus Communities, and it provides a nice way to share links and have conversations with small groups of your friends and colleagues. So let's go ahead and get started here. You can see I'm signed into my Google Spaces already, just using my Google account. And my Spaces Activities panel over here shows I have no activities currently happening right now. Let's go ahead and create a space. And let's just call this one Education Friends. And if we want to customize the background, we can go in and say Customize Space and choose a color layout. And we can choose a default header image if we want to or we can upload a picture of our own. I'll just use one here from uh, my Google account. and I'll save it. And now in this space I can go in and write something. Now I can put in a link if I want to. Let's say I found a great website and I want to share it with my friends. going to pull on a little site preview for me and I can say check out this site so that's one way you can post a message you can post just a picture image if you wanted to again pulling in from my Google account there I can also upload a picture if I want to and if I just want to write some text I'll just Hit the little quotation mark icon, and I can just write a post. I might say, reminder, we have a department meeting tomorrow. Now, if I want to invite my friends to join this community, just hit invite, and I can send them an email. I can send my friends a Facebook message or I can just say copy the link and of course I can then email that link or I can post it on my Google Plus community, I could post it in Twitter, any place that I would typically post a link to get my friends to join my community. Now let's go over here to the left hand side and check out some other options in Google Spaces. If we go to App Downloads we can now get a Chrome extension. And the Chrome extension will let me share any link that I come across to my Google Space. So we've installed that. And let's say I found this handy little tip and I want to share it in my space. So I'll just go up to the Spaces option. And I can say I'm going to post that to my education friends. And I'm going to say, great tip for making videos on iPads. And now it's posted to the space. You can say go to space and see what that looks like. And of course, if my friends want to come in and write a comment down below, they can write comments on that uh, post as well by going down here and tapping any one of those options, including little stickers, and say, ooh, that's fun. So that could be a comment. Or you could just simply write in, thanks for the tip. And so all the comments about that initial post of mine will appear there on the right-hand side. And close that out. We're back to the stream within my Google Space. So that's a short overview of Google Spaces. You can also install the iOS and Android apps to follow along with your Spaces conversations as well. And for more tips and tricks like this, please check out practicaledtech.com and freetech4teachers.com.